Hey, I can only 1997 here. Today, well, actually, it's still the same day as all the other videos. But I'm very bored. And I just figured that you know, share some of my knowledge with all the other people. Just like, I'm gonna show you some baits that I really recommend you get. Like, invest in. You know, they're just a few baits. It's called, there. It, it's a technique that's really hot now. It's called finesse. If you live near a lake that has big bass or a river or a good spot that has lots of fishing pressure and boat pressure, then you're going to probably want a few kind of lures that do good finesse now. One is the stinger. It's 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 from made by True Tungsten. They're big worms. I think they're probably like 7 inch. I don't know, but... They they have a really natural look to them. They are a freaky color. Like I don't know why they wouldn't make it like a natural if they're trying to be natural. But you want to Texas rig these things weightless. With like, I'd take um a worm hook or not a worm hook, just a regular hook. Um, like I'd make it a bigger one, not the extra wide gap. Well, I don't know what they're called, the regular ones, but whatever. Here it is. You gotta Texas rig this guy very good it's head weighted it's pre-weighted actually so it's a great finesse bait and f when you're finessing you want to get the idea of pretty much like you're just trying to coax the bass into biting you're just trying to you know wiggle really subtly action that kind of stuff and um when you're doing that another nice thing is a Senko when you want to put it on a small jig head and then I got this one and then I got this one, this isn't really a finesse Senko, this is just for fun. Big Senko. So, and you got this and that. Wacky rigged. I would call it finesse, but it's also top water. I mean, I don't know. I, I just put, put these guys on a jig head and you're good to go. What my main finesse bait, I, well, it's not my main, but it's like my, like as low as I can go. This is my last bait that I can use. It's called a robo worm. It's really nice for bass. It's really small. I mean, it's a small lure. It's fun to use. It's it, it, like just hook weightless, and it's it's got such a nice action. It's great for um to finesse. And another thing, we're all pretty much one of my real good finesse baits. My main finesse bait probably is this guy, the Strike King Shaky Tail Shad, or not Shad, Shaky Tail Worm. Oh, it's called a worm, but Paddle Tail. See him right there? A really good bait. It's like five inches probably, but it's really skinny. They're like six bucks a pack for five of them, but it's a really deal. Like, trust me, it's you want these in your tackle box. You really do. Because um, when the bass are finicky, you want to use this guy on a smaller jig head. You always want to use small when you're fishing finesse because that's just um it's just how it works. You, you you're able to fish the bait slower when you're using a light jig head, and it, it, well you're able to fish it slow with a heavy jig head too. But it just forces you to fish slow and use a lighter one. This is like three sixteenths of an ounce. It sinks very slow. Well, it doesn't sink very slow with this guy. These guys are small and they'll dirt down. But yeah, you just want to fish it like any other shaky tail, shaky head, worm, whatever. Um, and uh, finesse is also jigs. I'd use a jig for finesse sometimes. Finessing big bass. You know, I, I, it's not really my finesse kind of bait, the uh, jig. I, I only use it sometimes. This is like my last resort. Cause I don't think it, it's it's very they're very big for finesse baits jigs target big fish. So um where's my last one? Oh yeah. Um a tube is a very good finesse bait. You want to put um a nice heavy jig head or um head in there whatever they're called like tube heads. Whatever but yeah these guys are good. They're zoom mini tubes. You really need a small jig head though for them because they're sm they're really like midget tubes. But they're really nice, they're translucent. They're awesome. But, um, 
Anyway, I think that's... No, that's not it. Where is it? These are, like, my go-to bait. This is what I use before finesse. Three-inch minnow, gulp, um, quarter-ounce jig head, I guess. Something like that. Like, And I'll fish it on deep water. This is what I'll, that's what I'll use. <sighs> Man, I'm out of lures. <laughs> I did so many videos. I'm getting some new stuff soon. So, good luck fishing. Peace out. See you on the water.